smoking with the Migos. It's just me and me and Migos. Uh. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, another video for you guys and uh, update on my car, really, because I bet you guys a lot, a lot of you guys are concerned about it, and I'm very concerned about it. And still no news. Um, they're taking a lot of time. They're still investigating on the car. There's a 50-50 chance they could probably try to get it fixed. There's a 50 chance it might get totaled. Most likely, I feel like they're going to try and fix it. But the thing is, to be 100% real with you guys, it's not going to be the same, you know? A, a car that's been a clean title, one owner, uh, I've been very well taken care of. And I'm always going to have, in the history of the car facts, it's going to be like, frame damage or something like that you know it is what it is that's life i'm blessed you know there are some things you need to do when you are blessed which is bless others so i need to go out and you know do more for others but yeah that's the news on my car um if you guys saw the 350z also on my instagram the 350z went down to the shop um it needs a couple of things like i've replaced the control arm i'll show you guys I'll show, i've done a lot of things on the car but it still needs a couple more things done at the shop because i just don't have the tools for it so i took it down to the shop they're gonna be working on it but just more and more money stacking up i was saving up for the 350z easy to get fixed uh, but you know now I have to pay all kinds of stupid fees and especially like uh, and especially like this I forgot the name of this is just brain fart It's the fee you have to pay whenever you get in a car accident. There's like a minimum fee you have to pay for them to work on your car um, Forgetting the name for it, whatever basically I have to pay that fee because the other guy has absolutely no insurance and nothing to cover it um, unless I wait a month for the, the court date to pass and everything to go through and then I get my car back. I'm probably gonna end up doing that, guys, because I really don't have what they want. What they are asking is $1,500 from me, um, you know, to get my car back. I mean, the car has way more in damages. It probably has $4,000, he said, quoted, or 5,000 in damages. And they want $1,500 from me. And I, I just don't have that kind of money right now, especially with the Z getting fixed. I gotta get the Z back on the road uh, because I'm gonna need a daily. This rental is only for like a week left or something like that. So yeah, just very, very stressing. You know, that's life. Got finals coming up too. Just, just, just I don't need this stress. I couldn't even do my hair today because I just wasn't in the mood to be 100% with you guys. But anyways, to keep it on a positive note, um, my brother did get a, a carbon fiber spoiler for his car. So it's going to be a fun, exciting video getting that thing installed, probably changing the whole rear end of his car. Um, so we're going to go ahead and yeah, just install the wing and see how it looks. All right, so if you guys look at it, there's two spoilers here. That's from my car and that's from my brother's car. I took mine off my car because it was kind of loose when I when it got in the accident. I felt it. I don't know if it was always like that or whatever. I took it off because I don't want it to get in lost. You know, it's a couple hundred dollars for that. Um, so we got my brother's carbon fiber spoiler. I have a link to that in the description down below. Alright, it's my brother right now. He's uh, he's just but stop moving. How are you? Why are you moving so much? Do me. Yeah, do you and just work on the thing. Shit. My brother is working on his carbon fiber spoiler right now. Um, so he's getting all this. The, the, can you show him the, the tape on it, Theo? So if you guys can see, it, it was a pre owned one, but we got it for super cheap. Um, I found the exact same one on Amazon, so I'll link that down in the description. But if you guys see there, you guys can tell that it already had tape on there. We're, we're peeling off all the ones that are exposed. I'm going to apply new ones, and the one that already has red on there, we're going to leave it on there so we can uh, reuse it. All right, guys, so my brother just got all the, the tape off of the the spoiler there. So we're going to go ahead and slap that on. How do, how do you feel right now, Leon? Hopefully we'll smack it. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and slap it on. We'll see. All right, guys, what I noticed on YouTube is that people always tend to, um, like, put, like, an alignment, and they try to put on the spoiler and do all this extra stuff. It's really not that hard, guys. Watch how, watch how an Arab does it. All right, guys, and just like that, spoiler is on there. I don't, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it looks a lot better than mine. And it gives us such a better angle. So I love how this wing looks. So if you guys look at the rear, there's a lot more angle to it, unlike mine. So it gives it a lot more aggressive look. It looks amazing. Um, cannot wait for my brother to get a new bumper so we can start working on that. But honestly, this looks great. Really easy. All we're going to do now is go ahead and go over it with some heat. And that's all, guys. I mean, you really don't have to do the heat part, but the heat really ensures that it's not going to fly off anytime soon. Shot in Himalayan, 
says she's trying to get up on me I tell her like Habibti, that's too hot on my life Where they are, I was raised with Somali Everyone got a friend named Abdi I'm from OT 613